in this video we will solve a question it was asked by a person on youtube okay it is pretty simple question i have solved number of questions like this but because it has been asked so i cannot say no to the person question is given a firm's demand schedule is p is equal to 200 minus 2q this is our inverse demand function p is the price and q is the output and its total cost function is tc is equal to 2q q minus 14q squared plus uh, 222q that is 222q plus 50 we have to find out the total revenue, marginal revenue and profit, okay? So let's go one by one. What we are being given? We are being given the inverse demand function, okay? Price is expressed in terms of output and it is called the inverse demand function 200 minus 2Q, okay? To find um, total revenue, and we know total revenue is simply price into quantity, okay? Price function is being given. Okay, so in place of P, we have this stuff, we have 200 minus 2Q, to this we multiply by Q. So this will be our total revenue and if we simplify it, so our total uh, revenue will be equal to multiplying, you know, Q to each of these terms, it becomes 200Q minus 2Q square. Okay, this is the part one to find out the total revenue function. Next is to find out the marginal revenue. Marginal revenue, as we know, is uh, simple. The addition to the total revenue when an extra, you know, output is being produced. So marginal revenue is simply uh, the change in total revenue divided by the change in output. That means the derivative of total revenue function with respect to output. Derivative of Q is 1 by power function rule. So we are left with 200 minus What is derivative of Q square? It is simple 2 becomes coefficient Q 2 minus 1. So it becomes 2 Q only Okay, we know that if we have K to the power n its derivative will be n Q to the power n minus 1 exponent becomes coefficient and exponent is subtracted by 1 by power function rule pretty simple so this exponent becomes coefficient so 2 into 2 is 4 q so our marginal revenue it comes out to be 200 minus 4 q next is to find out the profit okay we know profit is simply total revenue minus total cost total revenue we calculated as uh, so pi will be equal to total revenue is 200 q minus 2 q square to this we subtract the total cost function that is being given us as 2q cube minus 14q square plus 2 to 2q plus 50 okay so our profit will be equal to 200q minus 2q square minus 2q cube minus into minus is plus 14q square minus into plus is minus 2 to 2q minus 50 okay so profit will be equal to let's write them in order in descending order in terms of exponent so we have minus 2q cube minus 2q square plus 14q square it will come out to be 12q square then we have minus uh, triple 2q and this stuff 200q so it will come 22q and obviously then we have minus 50 this will be the profit function for the firm i hope i hope i make myself clear in this video thank you